Now with the star of the new ABC show, The Rookie. You know Nathan Fillion from Castle, of course. Well, now he's playing a character who gets to completely reinvent his life as a cop. ABC's Adrian Banker sat down with him and is here right now. Great guy, right? Oh, my goodness. One of the nicest guys, Larry. Good morning to you. Yes, this show has all the action of a police drama with something a lot of us can relate to, the do-over. What do you do when everything falls apart? We talked to Nathan about playing the oldest rookie at the LAPD, his career, and how hard it was to do some of those stunts. I don't like you, Officer Nolan. It's not personal. I hate what you represent. A walking midlife crisis. The reason why I love the show is because I think there are a lot of people in their late 30s, 40s, 50s who have to reinvent themselves now yes. that they've arrived here. This is the new norm. This is the do-over. This is, this is what is happening now. Well, don't you think 40 is like the new 25? Let's keep talking about that. Yeah. Maybe that'll... <laughs> keep putting that out in the universe. Just tell, keep putting tell, it out there. Tell my knees that, though. So how in the world do you play a rookie police officer with the LAPD? I'm, I'm not a natural born sprinter, so spending my morning sprinting means waking up at the crack of 2 a.m. with a cramp down my leg that, you know, it feels like God is pinching you a little bit. Like, <laughs> it's, it's, it's that kind of thing. Sergeant Gray does not appear to be a fan of my presence in this department. Because you're old as hell? Look, I don't give a damn about your age, Officer Nolan. I want to know if you're going to be a speed bump on my path to chief of police. No, ma'am. Six months ago, I packed everything I owned into a U-Haul and moved here to become a cop. I got to work twice as fast, three times as hard. So I'm going to make you look good. Bit of an overshare, huh? I'm told partners are supposed to have a special bond. We're not partners. Obviously, people loved you on Castle. Yes. Do you think people are going to have a hard time seeing you as John Nolan and not Castle? They're going to come for you, Kate. Oh, my God, that never once occurred to me. Wait a minute, what? Um, <laughs> I don't think so. You know what? I don't think anybody's tuning into the show to, to see Castle. Officer John Nolan reporting for duty. That memorable voice that <laughs> we've come to know and love, it is in this character. True enough, yeah. uh, but, but Castle, he was, uh, he, his, he, he, he lived in a heightened reality. He, he was kind of no rules, no, not, he was, he it never, and boy, I got that, like, he never shut up. Mm -hmm. John, John Nolan is a, is a man of few words. What do you do to bring that relatability and not just be in the character? Uh, I think, I think my, my secret is underneath, you know, first you have, you know, the character, maybe underneath that is, is an actual Nathan going, yee, doing that all the time. This is me. Excitement. Come on. I mean, this is the, the lottery job. This is the fantasy. This is what you dream about doing. So you are living the dream. I really am. He's such a nice guy. Check out The Rookie tonight at 10 p.m. Eastern right here on ABC. I'm so watching that. I know. He's just adorable. You got, you got to love him, He's right, funny, everybody? Right? Yeah. I mean, <laughs> we're all going to watch. Him the best. Yeah. All right, Adrian, thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.